In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can adjust your units for measurement of your tide information between feet or meters on your Nixon high tide watch. Now I'm using the black and silver model. It shouldn't matter which version you've got. This video should work same for everybody. I'll also say that this watch has two different time uh, profiles on it. You've got a T1 profile and a T2 profile. Whatever you set, feet or meters will make that change on both profiles. You can't have one profile with feet and one with meters. They have to either both be meters or both be feet. So let's go ahead. The first thing you have to do is you have to be in your tide screen here. I'm already in my tide screen. It doesn't matter whether you're in T1 or T2. You can change this in either one of them and it will make the change globally. What we're going to do if we look, let's first look at some values. You'll see that my next uh, high tide or low tide occurrence is today at 1221 p.m. There's going to be a high tide of 0.51 meters. And then there's going to be a low tide at 409 a.m. of 0.12 meters. But what if you're somebody like me who you're not used to looking at uh, tide information in meters, you want to see it in feet, we're going to change that. So the way we're going to do it is we're going to press and hold this bottom left button. That is our mode button, but it will also take us into our settings when it's pressed and held. And now we'll see our values light up that we can change. So I can adjust my seconds. Now I'm simply going to press the bottom right button and it's going to take me to the different values I can change. Now I can change my minutes, can change my year, so on and so forth. We're just going to press it a few times until we get to a screen that says units. You'll see that mine's set to meters. I can use either one of these buttons up top. It's a simple toggle between feet or meters. Set it to whatever value you want. Once you're done, you can press this bottom left button. If you don't press anything for a few seconds, it will confirm the changes and save it automatically, but pressing the bottom left button will go ahead and do that for you. Now if you look, we're still seeing the same information we saw before, but if you'll notice, now my high tide is 1.69 feet. The low tide that we looked at before is 0.4 feet. So now we're looking at our information in feet versus meters. Pretty simple stuff. I hope the video helps. Thanks for watching.